Welcome to the grand premiere of Miura Mythbuster series, where we discuss common myths with our products and answer questions that are frequently asked by our customers. Today's myth revolves around Miura's water treatment and how it's more complicated than standard fire tube boilers water treatment. So with this in mind, let's ask the question, do Miura boilers require special water treatment? Now before we answer this question, let's cover a few points first. We're going to discuss the love-hate relationship with the handsome groom, steel tubes in the boiler, and the beautiful bride, water. Now when you get these two together, it's going to come with some consequences, like scale, corrosion, not being left alone, being asked to take out the trash constantly. Basically, water treatment in any boiler is monitored to control the buildup of scale and to mitigate the amount of corrosion within the boiler. Things like pH level, corrosive ions, iron, and hardness pose serious risk to the life of your boiler. So before we go any further, let's discuss more into scale and corrosion damage to boilers in general. Scale is the deposition of minerals in the water on the surface of the boiler. This buildup is commonly caused by hardness and usually consists of calcium and magnesium. As you would expect, this buildup is not good for any boiler. Scale buildup can result in lower boiler efficiency and even a ruptured boiler due to overheating. Scale is all around us. Just go look in your shower or sink. You might find some scale right around you in your own home. Now let's talk about the second boiler victim, corrosion. Corrosion is the gradual degradation of material by a reaction with the environment. It can fall to different classifications like uniform corrosion, galvanic corrosion, crevice corrosion, pitting corrosion, intragranular corrosion, selective leaching corrosion, many months later, stress corrosion, corrosion corrosion, erosion corrosion. Most water quality related corrosion can be caused by three factors in your water. Dissolved oxygen, low or extremely high pH levels, or harmful ions. These factors most typically lead to pitting type corrosion in your boilers. And things like this can eventually lead to a rupture, which is bad unless you enjoy watching the pain and suffering of our fellow boilers, which is just not cool. So how do we deal with all this evil? How do you treat water that is all up in your boiler? Well, how you would like to be treated, of course. Lesson one, how to combat the buildup of scale. The most commonly used way to prevent scale formation is with a water softener. The softener system is designed to remove the water hardness with ease, making your boiler stay up to speed and work efficiently. Lesson two, how to prevent oxygen corrosion to your boiler. One way to prevent oxygen corrosion is with the deaerator. The deaerator is in charge of lowering oxygen and other dissolved gases that naturally cause corrosion to steel. Another way you can remove oxygen is through chemical treatment, more on that later, or another removal method such as DOR, dissolved oxygen remover. Lesson three, how to go the extra mile for your boiler. Boiler treatment chemicals are used to inhibit corrosion within the boilers. There are many different types of boiler treatment chemicals, but they serve the same function in making the boiler last. Miura's patented Boiler Mate chemical treatment is a perfect pair with our water softeners and colorimetry system. The main ingredient of Boiler Mate is silicate, a corrosion inhibitor. Silicate is a naturally occurring material ideal for water treatment in Miura's once through boilers. Water tube corrosion can be controlled by balancing the amount of silicate in the water and the corrosive ions. Hopefully, now you can understand why this is important in all boilers. So to answer the question from the beginning, you know, the whole point of this video, no, Miura boilers only require the normal water treatment of preventing scale and corrosion just like a typical boiler. Now armed with this information, you too can help prevent the buildup of scale and corrosion. Thanks for watching this episode of Miura Mythbusters. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, make sure you subscribe to the Miura America YouTube channel, give us a like, and don't hesitate to meet us in the comments. Thanks, and we'll see you next time. Hey, don't them... <laughs> <laughs>